Hi everybody, it's Dr. Magnifico from JairsfulVetNapoly.com. This is Sadie, she's a puggle. Her mom came in today because there is something hanging out of her rectum. So this is fabric material string. Her mom, of course, tried to pull it already, which was met by screams. Um, so you have to be really careful. If there's something hanging out, like a piece of grass or even a human hair, that's one thing. But if it looks like it belongs to something that might be 20 feet long, you have to be really careful. So she is otherwise looking really good. So I am going to do a rectal exam to see if I can feel kind of how far this thing goes. If I can't feel the end of it, or I can't kind of milk it out of her abdomen, so I'm gonna put my hand on her abdomen and try to squeeze her colon to get it out, then we just cut off what we can see and we keep an eye for the rest of it. The good news is if it's gotten to the colon, so your colon is probably about this long, not yours, hers. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe ours too, I don't know. Um, if it's gotten to the colon, it's probably gonna pass fine. If it's in the colon and in the small intestines, it can cause an obstruction. And usually what happens is the intestines plicate, so they gather all together. And that we have to remove with surgery. So instead of just pulling, we're gonna kind of take a look. So I've got a gloved finger with lots of lube. And sometimes, if you're very lucky, I can put my finger up here and I can kind of feel how big it is. You know, this is the job of a veterinarian. It's a really glamorous life. Can you hand me a towel? I'm going to try to get it out <laughs> cleanly. Um, and this is like, this is digging poop out. So there it is. That's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> but that's it. You have to do it safely. You have to do it gently. You have to do it calmly. And you have to be prepared to stop. Don't keep pulling. If it's attached to something or anchored to something, you will rip out their intestines and then you will be definitely going to surgery. So that's it. Little things like a little piece of string or a little piece of a leaf or a little piece of hair is one thing, but if it looks like it's fabric, you have to be really careful. And I would rather have people just cut it at the rectum as long as they're acting normally, they're not vomiting, they're not straining to defecate, nothing's coming out. Then you can just sort of wait and see it pass. Um, but the rest of them, you are much better off going to your veterinarian, even if you leave them for the day so they can kind of monitor. Because the worst thing you can do is pull on something that's anchored somewhere in the body and you pull out those intestines and it happens. Um, if you have any questions about this, you can find me here at Jared's Vet or go to Pobbly.com. And thank you to Sadie for eating stuff that she shouldn't. <laughs>